Hi, I am Master Jambai. Welcome to this new replay commentary. I hope you guys will enjoy this is a new part of Grim vs. the World. Now, sometimes you don't understand what happened. Sometimes you, you are wondering why the game ended like that. This is one of these times. So, in case you missed any previous entry in Grim vs. the World, I choose Grim against any other seal that is higher in the tier list. Uh, so far, we are done with tier 0, we did most of 1, most of 2. And a few in three. This time around, my opponent shows Rachel, which is very interesting. Now, let's go over to Bolt Seal. Grim! Unit gain plus 30% attack, but lose 20% defense. Knuckle Buster for three stars. All unit attack is increased to 50. A maker for 6 stars. All unit attack is increased to 80. Overkill. Now, most of the time, I will suggest the player to use the power. It's much better than the super. Now, with this being said, let's read Rachel. Rachel, unit repair plus one, additional HP, liable for cost. So this means instead of uh, fixing two HP, she fixed three. And this is really, really good. It's very underrated. Well, actually, you don't always feel it, but I'm telling you, it's really good. I'd rather pick this up over my trash day to day. Now, the power is 3 stars and it's trash, don't use it, I judge people who should, now, recap, I judge people that actually consider using their power, it's a trash power, let's be honest, don't use it. Super Covering Fire. Six stars. Three, two, win. What is going on with me today? I'm still sick, in case you are wondering. Uh, so. Three, two, range. Missile deal. Three, HP damage. The missile target the opponent's greatest accumulation of foot soldier. HP, unit volume, and unit HP in that order. So she's basically broken term. Why not a good day today? So let's do that replay. I hope you guys will enjoy. We are near the end of this journey. The Grim vs. the World Journey. One can only assume the worst. So I will assume the website has still some broken replay here. Let's do this. Free Infantry, Dexter. Free Infantry, Dexter. Just some like normal stuff here. Nothing new. Capture. Capture, capture. So far, so good.
my first recall now if you know me you know how i feel about early recall early recall are very popular but i don't like them uh, i'd rather get a early tank instead i do think tanks are much better but i am grim so sometime just for fun I'm like, okay, let's have some recon, let's have some vision, let's kill some stuff, because that's what we do. Now, I look back and I don't change anything. <laughs> I know it's, it's not popular option, I do, but... Changing things around sometimes helps you out, and now I moved around too too much stuff by accident and I think he, he will base skip base skip don't do that kids it's wrong don't do that so, I get artery, tank, and infantry because I want to go up the pipe to link both sides. And I need tanks. At some point, I need tanks. So, uh, I, I think I did the right thing. So far so good outside of the war crime to base skip. Nothing happened. Now <laughs> okay. I can see the hatred. Recon are not there to shoot down other recon. Why did I do this? I know. It's Recon on Recon. I am Grim. And I think I got my extra tower. Maybe I don't. I don't know. But I will tell you this. Grim don't care about tomorrow. Grim is proud to do stupid stuff. Grim can shoot down Recon on Recon because he is dumb. So, usually I disagree to attack other Recon. In this specific case, I wanted to damage my opponent, maybe make it run away or something. And I, I think I will rewind, I'm not quite sure if I was able to, like, shoot something. So, I could have attacked that infantry there, but I didn't because it's in range. Well, actually, no, it's a bit too far, but I think... My thought process is attack volume. And at some extent, I was right for once. Uh, don't do recon on recon. In this specific case, I do agree. It's fine. Because you are grim, you can do stupid stuff. Grim like for strike and even engagement. This is the grim way to do stuff. And even w when you're unit are damaged as grim you can accept to do stupid trade grim is a very aggressive seal and i i do think i did the right thing there uh, if i go back and do this again i will do the same because it's grim and grim wants to crush stuff 
so let's see. Kill my infantry. Run away with the Raycon. Thank Infantry Artery. Now I look this and I laugh because one, two, three, four, five, six. And I think I can do tank on tank here. Yeah. Damage the infantry. Kill the infantry. So far so good. Another Raycon because why not? I got the money. And I also got a battle copter. Now as Grim Battle Copter are really, really good. Uh, Grim uh, Battle Copters are among the best in the game. Because, let's be honest, only Kanbai has better Battle Copter than Grim. Even Eagle cannot compete with Grim Copter. Or actually, I forgot about Sensei. Sensei has better Battle Copter. Outside of, like, Sensei and Kanbai, Grim has the better Copters. And this is funny because I realized Yellow Comet like their battle copters. I just realized that. So let's kill stuff. Look at that. One shotting infantries with the battle copter. This is all good green battle copter are. Take a look, 16 unit against 25, it's crazy, she base skips and I killed so many of my enemy units but then my unit are melting as well, amazing right? Now she got the anti-air over here, now I do think the anti-air could have been better here, but... He still had the right reflex, so... Capture the building! Damage kill! Battlecopter tank and two infantry, I believe, yeah. So, now some people may ask Battlecopter spam wrong! I am Grim. I don't care. I shoot stuff. Let's keep going there. Kill my unit. Capture the building. Damage. Kill. So you see my unit are melting. This is why we need to be uh, overly aggressive as Grim. Megs? Okay, whatever. Megs are trash. The Knuckle Buster! OP OP! Let's see what we can do with this. First strike, almost kill. Damage! Kill! Damage! Kill! Kill! Oh! This turn, this turn is violent. I killed so many enemy units. It's crazy. Another battle copter because why not? And I think this ends there. Yeah. So my opponent resigned. And this is why I am wondering why. I look at the unit count. I have twice his number. So my power was really good. Maybe this led to my opponent losing and giving me the win. Now, he got his covering fire out, first of all. 
second. I don't know how that opening could have changed anything. Outside of the war crime to base skip, I don't see any mistakes. I really don't know what happened, what led to this. Now, if the game kept going, 29 to 14, I really don't know. I really don't know. Maybe that capture could have done a lot of damage to my tank. I really don't know. So this is the kind of game you're like, is it a good win? I hope you guys enjoyed this very short replay commentary. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe for more Advanced Wars content. Have a great day!